Hi there, my name is Dr. Dominic Rowley and I'm the medical director of Let's Get Checked. I'm here today to talk to you about a hormone called FSH, or follicle stimulating hormone. So what is FSH, or follicle stimulating hormone? Well, as I mentioned, it's the hormone that's produced from the pituitary gland in the brain. It's a really important hormone and it's got multiple functions, but primarily in female uh, patients, it, it controls your menstrual cycle and it also controls the release of eggs from your ovary, uh, ovaries, also known as ovulation. In men, FSH um, is responsible in part for the production of sperm, um, although it tends to remain more constant than the FSH levels in females, which can fluctuate according to the time of her menstrual cycle. Why would you uh, ask for your FSH to be tested? Or why would your doctor suggest that your FSH gets tested? Well, look, this could be for multiple reasons. As I mentioned in women, it has multiple um, jobs to do, including uh, regulation of the menstrual cycle and also regulation of your reproductive system. So women who are having difficulty conceiving, if you've been having unprotected sex for six to 12 months with difficulty conceiving, uh, your doctor may suggest you get your FSH checked. If you have abnormal bleeding um, or abnormal periods, and this is new for you, that would be also be another reason to get your FSH levels checked. And I suppose one of the most common reasons to get your FSH levels checked would be if you feel you might be perimenopausal or around the time of menopause or that you've gone through menopause. Um, and this might also be a reason to get your FSH checked. For men, indeed, the same thing might apply. If men are struggling to conceive and they want to have a full battery of tests, uh, they might have their uh, FSH checked. So what might affect the results of your FSH test? Or what might make your FSH test results not so accurate? Well, a number of different uh, factors. If you're, for example, taking hormones such as progesterone or estrogen, these of course will affect your, your FSH levels. Uh, older age or uh, younger age, so extremes of age might affect your, test, uh, your um, FSH levels. If you're taking birth control pills, this is possibly uh, will affect your um, FSH levels. And very heavy cigarette smoking has been known to be a causative factor in abnormal FSH levels. But if you're in any doubt at all, um, please contact one of our nurses through Let's Get Checked and they will be best placed to advise you about the best test that's suited for your needs.